Hey YouTube, welcome back. Um, previously, I did a video on uh, uh, how I try to recover these uh, three phones because uh, all of this uh, three flip phone was uh, water damage. So I'm just going to go review real quick of uh, what I did. So I remove those uh, two screws over here. And then I uh, remove the back cover. I also remove the SIM card. And after that I pop it out the uh, circuit board and then uh, uh, put it into uh, an ultra cleaner. If you don't uh, know what's that, I got a links uh, showing in the description below and I'll link it to uh, the ultra cleaning uh, process that I did for the iPhone that I did previously so this is the this was the water damage uh, because the, the red dot right there so I'm gonna test this phone out This phone was in the washing machine for like a full cycle. <laughs> Unfortunately, the battery, I try to charge it, it is it's bad. So I need to buy another new battery for it. Um, as you can see, the sc screen come up, and there's a front screen. The camera also work on this, but unfortunately, there's a line, line, line through it. Let me see if I can try to go up there. Take a picture and show it to you. What's it look like? See, there's a line. It's not because of the screen is bad. It's the camera. Uh, the camera that got water damage. So I believe the the camera I need to replace also. But if you don't want to, it. You might take a bad picture, but you can still take a picture with it. Okay. So this one uh, came back, I guess. Should be 100%, but all you need to do is just uh, put a new, replace a new battery and replace, uh, put a new camera in there. So everything will work again. With this uh, Samsung uh, flip, I try to rescue it and I put the circuit board into the ultrasonic for a 10 cycle. Uh, each cycle I did it with three minutes. But somehow this one is not coming on. I'm not sure if I have the dead battery or uh, or uh, what's going on with this one because uh, this phone might be in the water for a long time and the the user never removed the battery when the phone was water uh, dropped in the water. So in that case, you might short circuit the whole board for a long time period so this one I did the same thing remove the back cover and then uh, take out the circuit board and drop into the ultrasonic cleaner 
So as you can see, the, pair, uh, the phone works fine. But this one, the originally the LCD was already broken, so it's not gonna display anything. So. So overall, of these three phones, two of them came back alive, which is pretty good. So if you uh, have a water damage phone and you, if you would like to use my same method that I did, you could just uh, click on the link below and follow the step and process and hopefully you will get successful on fixing your phone or bring them back alive, okay? Thank you for watching the video. Hopefully you will give a thumbs up, like, comment below, and subscribe uh, to our channel because we have uh, a lot of video will be uploaded soon. So I'll see you on the next video. Peace.